Welcome back. From a world-renowned art museum in East Lansing, to a world-class performing arts center in Charlotte, to a worldwide day of comic book creativity in downtown Lansing, your pick a place week to winner is already an international success story. And as you're about to see, it also has plenty of local high-flying flavor to it. Take a look. Reading and collecting comic books. It's a tradition that's literally turned the page on 75 years of fantasy and adventure. And here in downtown Metropolis, I, I mean Lansing, Clem's Comics is the site of World Comic Book Day. So let's head inside and see some of the sites of the top place you picked this week. And don't worry, you have the world's most famous comic book reporter character on the job. Isn't that right, Lois? Hey, you look familiar. Don't give away my secret. One of the great things about comic books, it doesn't matter how old you are, you find things to love about them. Just like my friends, Sam, Owen, Zachary, and Sarah. Who's your favorite comic book character, buddy? Iron Man. Who's yours? Hulk. The Hulk. What's your favorite comic book, buddy? The Secret Wars. The Secret Wars. And who do you like, sweetheart? Strawberry Shortcake. Strawberry Shortcake. Superman, last of a Krypton. I can, you know, introduce you to him if you want to meet him. Oh, yeah. You do want to meet him? Okay, let, let me see what I can do, because I, I, I might know him, you know. <laughs> All right. We're now talking with Alec Davis, the store manager of Clem's. Al, why is this day so special for both you guys and all the fans who we've seen come through? Well, nationwide, comic shops all are just like giving away free comic books uh, by the thousands, just attracting new fans all over the place, and it's really not slowing down at all. And how about all the people who are dressing up as comic book characters? Uh, in no way, shape, or form am I one of those people. Fantastic, they put a lot of dedication into what they do, and it's amazing to see the people that, you know, the costumes that they come up with. You know, you'll see a stormtrooper here or there. There's a saying this time of year at World Comic Book Day. May the fourth be with you. Are you four? No. No. Fans of comic books aren't the only ones here at Clem's. We also have artists and writers. Kaylin Smith, thank you very much for being here. Thank you. What is it like to draw, conceive, produce your very own comic book? It is awesome. It started out as a hobby. It is a Western adventure. I fell in love with it. Putting the whole writing and the art together, and here it is, comic book. This is what he would look like if I were to draw him in my comic. And we're ready for the big Clark Kent reveal. What do you think? I think it's super. <laughs> yes, it's super. Thank you. Thank you. And there you have it, a flyby tour of World Comic Book Day at Clem's Comics. Hey! There's no need to fear. Thanks for helping me pick a super place only on TV6. fly over to the other part of the studio. I think my cape fell off. Well, Evan said he lost the cape, also lost the S, but ladies and gentlemen, he's still wearing his tights. Thank you. Thank you. So nice. we this are. This is the sky. I can like. It's a bird. It's a plane. It's pencil. <laughs> <laughs> I'm supposed to do weather now. <laughs>